just wish we knew what to do with them. Maybe they'll go away. Yeah, I don't think they will, Psy King. What do they want? I think they want a feast, man. Here's the situation. Nick's body is sending you all sorts of sensory input. Smells, tastes, visuals, sounds, tactile feedback. You've just got to deal with it. We know how to deal with a crowd, man. Speak for yourself. I don't remember a thing. You know, vision sounds a lot like my friend Ford. Were you in a band with Ford Cruller? <laughs> Good old vision. He always had such a good eye for, you know, visuals. I see. Well, maybe when your full memory returns. want you guys. Yeah, it's always rough on the opening act. Sorry. I just wish we knew what to do with them. Maybe they'll go away. Eh, I don't think they will, Psy King. What do they want? I think they want the feast, man. Oh, they look mad. Well, they'd be happy if we could just play for them. want you guys. Yeah, it's always rough on the opening act. Sorry. You know what this crowd wants? Yeah, they came for a feast of the senses. 
so give it to them. Oh, wow, man, it's been so long, I, I, I don't even know where my violin is. What is a Feast of the Senses? Is it a band? Well, it's more than a band, man. It's a non-stop festival of sights, sounds, smells, feelings, and flavors. And yes, it was our old band. Our old friends. What happened to the feast? Well, the audience just disappeared one day. And the band drifted apart. Uh, I'd do anything to get the band back together again. Who was in the band? Uh, besides me, there was uh, Tasty, Dr. Touch, Audio, Sniffles, and of course, on the mic, we had the Psy King. I'll find your violin. Just tell me where you last used it. Can I even remember what it looked like? Yeah, if only you could see the world the way I see it. Huh. I thought the inside of an eyeball would be... goopier? <clears throat> testing, this kinda testing. Reminds me of our old stage setup. Coincidence. Check one. Check one. Check. What's that? A new friend? No, an old friend then. That's right, it's that kind of world. Two. The tip of... Can we check one, two? Check one, two, three? Check, check, check one. Check, check. Sibilance, sibilance. Fast. Check this out. Whoa! When you
you're alone as long as I was, time loses some of its meaning, and your perception of it becomes your reality. Want to give it a try? Try your time bubble on those platforms. Is this all the colors there are? I'm starting to remember that there might be more. Is that a fish? I think it's a fish! Or a bus! I forget which is which. Uh, testing is check, check. Are you copper bottoming them, my man? No, I'm aluminiuming them, my man. I've got eyes on the target. And I've got eyes on me. Hi! I see the violin! Did you see it? Sorry if you already saw it, I just think we should be checking in with each other. You know? Oh, 
What's this? Do you eat it? Only if you're not careful. Ooh, those look dangerous. Let's go somewhere else. <laughs> So pretty, so wise. use the thought tuner while I'm inside a mine. I'm surrounded by so many stray thoughts. It might explode. Or, you know, once we get these the really light tickers sound. hooked up, the stage show is gonna be incredible. These friends are different. That certainly took a long time. Come on, my fans are. I don't like the look of that thing. Don't 
television I said this, but eyeballs are kind of gross. If you look at them closely, I already feel horrible for saying that.
better, but to handle a crowd that size, we need the whole band, man. We need Tasty, Sniffles, Dr. Touch. And Audie. Yeah, audio. o You're remembering, man. <laughs> Where are they all now? Oh, they wandered off when the audience left. Could be anywhere. This festival covers so many acres. Hey! <gasps> Didn't we used to have a cool band van? Fear m o b i l e I'll bet they're still at the festival somewhere. Woohoo! So what's driving? You better drive. I don't want to brag, but uh, I've got um, eyes. These are the concession stand. If they got hungry, they'll be here. Good idea. Let's look here. Tasty and Sniffles hung around here a lot. Oh, so many scents and flavors. And lines, man. So many long lines. I'll go find Tasty and Sniffles. Wow! Look at all the nicks. They sound hungry. into that hungry crowd, they would eat me. So good, but also bad, you know. I don't want to use the thought tuner while I'm inside a mine. I'm surrounded by so many stray thoughts. It might ex. Excuse me. Hang on, kid. We're trying to decide what to order. You can eat after the show. Vision and Psy King are waiting by the van. What? Psy King is back. 
Let's get our instruments. We've been in this line for so long, I'm not even sure where they are. Why don't you just buy new instruments? My instrument is like a part of me. Yes, mine too. But part of me I set down somewhere and I can't remember. Do they have corn dogs? If so, that's what you should get. Kid, the psyching is back. This is no time for eating. I can't believe I just said that. guys let me take a look. I'll bet I can find them. Oh, Tasty, I can't decide. Well... Maybe I can find their instruments before they make up their minds. I have to admit, I'm a little afraid of this one. I Why, swear I can the taste and this thing. <laughs> That's all just part of being in a band, man.
guess this is more tongue than I would prefer. Oh, these things feel weird. I can taste you. Wanna know what you taste like? Not really. You taste like shoes. But it's new ones. that smell? Oh, God, it's my own sweat. Hey, hey, don't. I can smell my own sweat. You're not supposed to be able to do that, are you? Oh, God. Now I can taste it. What's that smell? Oh, God, it's my own sweat. Hey, hey, don't. I can smell my own sweat. You're not supposed to be able to do that, are you? Oh, God. Now I can taste it. Good. 
And good for you. You know what that thing I told you about slowing down time? Response is triggering. I say lie. Lies! Here we go. What's that smell? Oh god, it's my own sweat. Hey, hey, don't. I can smell my own sweat. You're not supposed to be able to do that, are you? Oh god. Now I can taste it. Oh, I... What's that smell? Oh god, it's my own sweat! Hey, hey, don't! I can smell my own sweat! You're not supposed to be able to do that, are you? Oh god, now I can taste it! Response is triggering. I say fine. My heart is racing. I have a heart. Oh no. I can't breathe. Get out of here. My fight or flight response is triggering. I say fine. My heart is racing. Do I have a heart? Oh, phew. Oh, yeah. Back to my regular smell again. Which, if I'm being honest, I've never heard any complaints about.
That nostril is as hairy as a St. Bernard turned inside out.
Most people just don't appreciate flavor. But I loved it. Ooh, that's a good look on you, Psy King. We need to get the whole band back together, am I right? We need Dr. Touch. And we need audio. I could really use a drink. The audience hates us. I can taste it. I need time to practice my licks. The audience hates us. I can taste it. Are you excited about getting the band back together, Vision? I will be as soon as Artie O and Dr. Touch are with us. I need time. So, why aren't you the singer? You wouldn't ask that if you ever heard the Psyching sing. He is amazing. He's the best. Oh, please, you're making me blush. The Sentai, very funny. Hey, how are you, Ball of... I mean, Psyching? I'm a little overwhelmed, but, you know, too much sense is better than none, right? I could really use a drink. I can't wait to write a book about this. Still have two more bandmates to find. Let's go somewhere else. Everybody, back in the van. Can't beat that old van smell. Where are we going? Careful. This van's barely holding together as it is. We're not here to run people over, all right? Ooh, I bet we'll find some of them at the camp. They might have wandered into the campgrounds. It's true. Whoops. Ooh, our promoter's not gonna like that. Sorry. We're not here to run people over, all right? Whoops. This van's barely holding together as it is. Good idea. Let's look here. Let's go somewhere else. Everybody, back in the van. Sorry. I don't want to brag, but a uh... good idea. Let's look here. You know, Vision sounds a lot like my friend Ford. Were you in a band with Ford Color? Ah, uh, good old. I see. Well, let's go somewhere else. Everybody, back in the van. They might have wandered into the campgrounds, it's true. Ooh, our promoter's not gonna like that. Ooh, I bet we'll find some of them at the campgrounds. Good idea. Let's look here. Well, this is the campground. Dr. Touch and Artie used to like to come here. They like to get high out here. So, you're saying they're up there? Yep. And the view up there is amazing. It's good to see you again, Vision. 
I say it's good to see anything. Am I right? Whoa, Audie and I used to sneak up here and talk about our hopes and dreams. So beautiful. I've heard about music festivals like this, but this one is surprising and clean. <laughs> Still, where are all the bathrooms? Oops. Always do. No, we don't. See? Here you go. Me? You started this. Oh, choo-choo. Here comes the blame train. For someone who's all ears, you really don't know how to listen. For someone who's all fingers, you broke... Didn't you guys see the huge crowd down there? People are screaming for the Feast of the Senses. That's what I've been telling this one. But the problem with him is that he just won't listen. Without Psyking, there is no feast. There's nothing. But Psyking is back. What? He's down by the van with Vision. But we're not ready. We haven't practiced. Dr. Touch, where are our instruments? I, I thought you had them. We need those instruments. The crowd's getting angry. Hey, that kind of pressure is not helping. Yes, that makes us just want to stay up here. We're in safe. Maybe you could perform without your instruments? What could we possibly perform without our instruments? Hmm, magic? I do know a little sleight of hand, you know. Please. Let me take a look. I bet I can find it. Sounds good to me. Let me give you a hand. Okay, two instruments coming up. I love what they've done with the place. Okay, let's get those instruments and get out of here. If I know Audi, this is gonna sound awesome. Oh, and Dr. Touch is good too. Oh. Careful. Dr. Touch can be a little handsy. Slowing that down. I was about to suggest it. 
instruments. Nothing between me and them except that innocuous looking empty platform. Audie and I used to sneak up here and talk about our hopes and dreams. So beautiful. Yep. space and dimension now. Stay calm. I feel like I'm about to go on stage. 
can't breathe. Stay calm, man. Stay calm. I feel like I'm about to go on stage. I don't like it here. My fight or flight response is triggering. I say mine. Feeling better. I'm ready to help. Hey, where'd he go? The question isn't what you know, but what you feel. Oh, I gotta say, Sacking, you're almost looking like your old self again. I'm sorry I abandoned the band, you guys. Hey, it's gonna make for a better rockumentary someday. Time for the feast. Feast! Just a thought is all I've got Now my cover's low At the bottom of a lake Of frozen feeling When my friends pulled me back up I started healing Cosmic eye Senses are the magic keys They fill the holes I've had Unlocking all my memories I never, never bed. Wanna bet, Helmut? Uh-oh. Oh, oh no. no, not, not again. again. I know her! From Lobato's nightmare. I know her from my nightmares. <laughs> Don't worry. All your friends are here. Friends? Oh, do you mean these friends? The ones who abandoned him in the ice for 20 years. Don't listen to her. Dear universe, please, shut up! There we go. That's better. Problem solved. Ball of light? You're a helmet full bear. Everyone thinks you died in the deluge of Grulovia. What happened? <sighs> I can't remember much of anything. Well, if you don't mind, I can try to help with that.
What's going on here? Ah, this was my stupid plan to defeat Maligula. You okay? So far. You okay? You were going to act her to death? I did a monologue about Lucy's life and what she meant to us. To try and bring her back. I was useless that day. You think you were useless that day? I tried to stop her with a motivational speech. Actually, Fulbert, you distracted her long enough that I was able to recruit some local animals to help. Which also didn't work. We all brought what we had to the battle. The main thing was, your beautiful performance did bring out the old Lucy. Just for a bit. It reminded us that she was in there. So, Maligula used to be... your friend? And her name was... Lucy? <sighs> See this? I'm learning a lot. Yeah. You guys! I'm right here! Where are you going? Why did you all abandon me for a thousand years? Twenty. Maybe in your world? Did they even look for me? Did they all forget I existed? We did look for you, fool bear. But my stupid Hyper High Glaciator there, which we brought to freeze Maligula, well, it, uh... It worked as designed, Otto. But you were so deep in that frozen lake, we couldn't find you. No matter how much we duck. I know you're just speculating here, Helmet. I think you're probably right. But I sent you my brain, Ford. Didn't you find it? I... I don't know. Ford must have brought your brain back because I found it in Otto's lab. But he must have lost that memory when his mind was shattered in the battle. My brain was shattered? Well, come on. It was a little crack to begin with. If my body's been in high-press all this time, I'll bet I look amazing. Almost done. I'm starting. Oh no, I can't look. This is where that monster drowned my Bobby. Because I failed. Because my stupid plan couldn't save him. No, you saved me. You threw yourself into the path of danger, sacrificing yourself to save me. Rather dramatically, I might add. Well, I mean, thank you. So, I'm not dead. I'm out there somewhere waiting for you to come back to me. I'm coming to you, right now. I swear. Better hurry. You know how I get. Memories, my boy. Just a show we put on inside our heads. Sometimes the first draft of the script stinks. Thanks for helping me with the rewrites. Now let's go give the people what they want. <laughs> Everybody stand back! Remember, this is our friend, Lucy! She's going through a tough time. I think she might just need someone to listen to her. Save your sympathy for your shrubbery, Zanato. Time out, Lulu!
I haven't found your body yet, Forbear, but not to worry. I've got your brain, and I'm going to keep it safe back at HQ and come back for the rest of you. Just after I figure out what to do with Lucy. Okay. I know you won't forget about me. I don't think anybody's going to forget about you after that performance. In fact, I think they're demanding an encore. Senior staff only. I'm... Who am I again? Nick John Smith. Nick John Smith, senior mailroom staff. Welcome, Helmet Fulbear, deceased. About time they sent me an assistant. Ford's gonna be so excited when he figures out who you really are, Agent Fulbear. Everybody is. Kid, I owed you one, and now we're square. But I'm not ready to face Cruller. Not until I talk to Bob. But... Lots of baggage to unpack. You wouldn't understand. But please, tell no one of my return. But... I'll see you at curtain call! Oh, somebody shut that door before the wind blows all my letters away! Straight thoughts around. Yep. Excuse me, Agent Crawler? Clerk Crawler. Yes. How are you feeling? Busy. It's like nobody's been sorting the mail for days. Mind if I uh, went inside your mind and sorted a few things out? Eh, I'm never opposed to anything getting properly sorted. <laughs> 